All right, we're gonna start by on each side, on the end of the cooler, cut out a little hole where this will mount inside. And we're gonna do that on both sides. Okay, when you're done cutting your holes, it's gonna look something like this. Probably look a little cleaner than what I've done, but it is what it is. All right, now we're gonna mount the fans inside. One will be blowing in and one will be blowing out. I just got a cheap cooler. You might wanna get stronger fans. And watch the kitty. It has to be all in the middle of something. Go on, put your head in the hole, be cute. Nope, it's not doing it. Okay. Okay, so when your desk looks something like this, this one blows out, that fan blows in, these are USB, I got a mess on my floor from cutting the styrofoam, I'd get one of these, and now what we're going to do is we're going to fill it with ice and plug it in, then I'm going to use my handy pointer, so we can get a temperature reading and move kitty you're not helping okay now I have the cooler full of just ice one's blowing out one's blowing in go ahead and put the lid on it blowing good Surrounding area is 24 Celsius. Coming out of the hole, and the longer it sits, the cooler it will get. Fahrenheit. As you see, the longer it sits, the cooler it's going to get. Instant air conditioner. The two little fans and everything together cost about $15. After you get it at this point, all you have to do is buy ice. After about five minutes, I would suggest a bigger cooler, more ice. And I got these little fans off Amazon. They were only $5, so they're not really blowing that hard, but you're getting the idea of it. So when you're having a 110 degree temperature, you can make a couple of these, might cool you off a little bit. I hope this helps somebody.